So in this session, I will show you how to log on to VCL and use uh, full screen for your remote desktop connection and also how to print to a file and transfer it to your own computer. So vcl.ualberta.ca, log into the virtual computer lab, University of Alberta, proceed to log in, use your CCID and password, new reservation. Now, let's say an hour, create reservation, one minute remaining. So I have to wait a minute until the, uh, the virtual lab or the virtual computer is ready. Now the virtual computer is ready, I'm going to press connect. So you need to download the remote desktop connection file, so this RDP file. So I'm going to click on get RDP and then I'm going to open, uh, so show in folder and then I'm going to right click and click on edit. And uh, in display I'm going to move this to full screen. So I'm going to utilize the full screen for the remote desktop connection. Connect, connect, and the password. I'm going to use the password that's supplied here. F W Z E F capital L. Okay. F W Z E F capital L. Connect. And now the remote desktop connection is using the full screen. So I'm going to show you now how to print uh, or to print a file and then transfer it to your own computer so that you can use it for um, to print it off for your assignment. So it's going to take a minute here to load all the uh, kind of programs on the remote computer. So once you're logged on, you can start Wolfram Mathematica. So I'm going to create a, a quick uh, file here. I'm going to then use it to then I'm going to print it off. So notebook, I'm going to say x or for example y is equal to 20x. And then I'm going to plot y when x is between 0 and 10 shift enter so let's say I want to print this the easiest way is to print you can directly print it to your printer if you if your computer is connected to a printer or you can basically print it to a Microsoft XPS document print, save it on your desktop, give it a name, question one, then I'm going to right click, copy, and I'm going to paste it on my own machine paste and here you can print this or you can simply convert it to Adobe PDF if you have Adobe PDF on your own machine and here's your PDF file that you can print directly to a printer 